okay, you can start dragging things around to different locations on Foursquare now. Um, that's really awesome. So you can pin the map. The big problem is, uh, for me at least, I, I'm not sure on the exact location of the observation tower. And unlike Gowalla, this Google map is set up uh, without the lovely aerial assistance. I don't even know what that means. Okay, so what you do is you go to uh, Google Maps and you have to be signed into Google and you want to click on My Maps and then you want to browse the directory and you want to find the, oh, what's it called? Uh, the Foursquare, Foursquare Maplet. It's under new, say Add to Maps. So now it's been added. I'm going to go back to Maps. I'm going to get to my location. Boop, 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 boop. And now I'm going to answer the telephone and get back to you. Okay, sorry about that. Um, then you'll see down here it says uh, four square maplet. And you want to make sure that that's checked. And here's what happens when it's not checked. Whoop, something happened. Let me zoom in here. So here we go. Here's a. So when you have the Foursquare maplet, you can actually see places that have been pinned in Foursquare on the map. So now what we're worried about is this observation tower. I'm not quite sure if I pinned it correctly. So what I'll jump to is the satellite, and you'll see I was pretty darn close. You can. I think it could actually move a little bit over. So what we'll do is we can go back here, move it just a tad over, put it right on the street, I guess. I think that would work best. And now let's see if I refresh this, if it moves over. Oh, you know what happens if you refresh it? Uh, major fail.